Nothing better than cruising around the island of Kauai with my right hand man, Hunter. Hunter, what are we hungry for? Poke. Exactly. Now, Dad, how do you find the best poke? You know, what do you look for? Well, I mean, there's places all over, but I gotta tell you, you talk to the locals, you look around, and when you pull into a parking lot and you see a line like that, you gotta check it out. This is Hanalei Poke. We got a spicy village. It's just such a mm, wonderful taste experience. And I'll drive halfway across the island to have it. We got a local boy. So there's awesome poke places everywhere. What yeah. do you think sets it apart? The fresh ingredients. Like, really fresh? Because Jeremy Burwell's personal fish guy is Jeremy Burwell. I started selling fish to, like, little restaurants. And then decided to keep his catch for his own spot. Why does everybody flock to the little truck? The quality of our fish. We go the extra mile the way we cut it. Very small pieces. That way, no one ever gets that, like, big old chewy uh, sinew ahi piece. This, to me, is probably one of the most important things you can learn. Can you teach, Hunter? Sure. These are koshibis. It's a small ahi. Start at the head. That's a fin. Tail fin, whatever. Yeah, you wing. Know, this meat comes all the way to here. Did you call it a wing? <laughs> oh, you make it look so easy. Is that all right? Yeah, I'm all nervous, like he's playing Little League or something. Like, swing the it's like, it's like operation. Now we're going to turn it around for you. Now you're, like, lifting. Just like cool. that, right in the ice. Like that in the back of the car. Cube all this, and now we start to build the bowl. Yeah. And he's mixing things up with what he's mixing in. Kalia plate with sushi rice. Kalia bowl is great because it's got some fruit in there and the nuts as well. He brings in a new flair that just makes it really amazing. OK, let's see it. This is how we make our sushi rice. First, we wet our hangiri so the rice doesn't stick to it. Nice big hangiri you got here. When you're making sushi rice, this makes all the difference in the world. To get that rice right, absorbing the moisture. Yep. OK, so the rice is cooked inside this rice bag. Sugar. Rice wine vinegar. Pour it over the rice. Just folding it in there. Excellent. All right, we're going to do the kealia. Fresh ahi, fresh ono, green onion. Fresh limu right here. Uh, seaweed. We'll throw a little bit of red onion, mango, watermelon, beautiful local avocados. They got fresh everything, man. Fresh mint, basil, cilantro grown on site right over here in the garden. Macadamia nuts. Just a little bit of inamana. Inamana. What is inamana? It's a roasted kakui nut and some red pepper. And this is our sesame oil sriracha mix. Mm, that looks good. Finishing touch for chili pepper shoyu. Kaylee, a plate. Where's your plate? <laughs> Taking my lines? Mm. I'm trying all kinds of flavors I've never had in a poke bowl. The mint, the watermelon. That watermelon is so good in there. That is so refreshing. Really nice. The kakui with the mint, game changer. You've got creamy, spicy, salty, nutty, crunchy. The macadamia nut? It makes the salad even better. Honestly. It really does. It does. That's ono delicious right there. That is yeah. delicious.